Hey, what's good guys? It's Cameron. Today I'm bringing you a two-way break starter point guard that is probably the main build I've been running with lately. Um, insanely fun build, can spot up, gets contact dunks, has incredible, incredible defense and great playmaking ability. So you're going to be a point guard. 6'7", 198, 7'4", wingspan. That 198 is very specific. It allows us to get Hall of Fame clamps, which... You know, a lot of the ways I play with lockdown, I don't really go for steals. I just try to go for, you know, body ups, being able to stay in front, get a bad shot, get a rebound, and start a fast break. So to dive into the stats, you have a 75 close shot, 78 layup, and an 84 dunk, as well as a 34 standing dunk. Um, you're definitely going to get some good contacts, get some good animations. Um, the layup's high enough with Pro Touch, you will be able to green it. And the big part with this build is that Hall of Fame Pro Touch. Extremely, extremely important badge, so it's great to be able to have that on this build. Um, really solid finishing, um, and you've got some great speed to pair with that. So diving into the shooting, you have a 77 three ball, 62 mid-range, 71 free throw. One word for shooting this year with the low three ball, and that's Claymore. Um, I get Claymore gold on this build i believe so i just have it as high as i possibly can and then i kind of dive into maybe bronze volume shooter catch and shoot corner specialist and truthfully i don't mess with tier three badges there's no point you only get them on bronze and i think you can get some more value elsewhere especially with your limited shooting badges uh looking at your playmaking you have an 80 pass accuracy so you get gold dimer and gold floor general tier one Myself, personally, I run both those badges for my teammates just to make it easier on them to shoot, especially if I'm driving and dishing. They're leaking out, going corner on a fast break. It just takes some pressure off of them. 78 ball handle, 77 speed of ball. You do get Zach Levine packages and Michael Jordan's dribble style, which are great for 6-7 builds. Um, very, very solid uh, animations. So the defense is obviously where this build shines, and it's just ridiculous. So you have an 83 interior defense. You'll be getting contests, you'll be getting blocks, um, you'll be holding your own down there. Um, post looks got patched, so I ran into like a 7 foot, 7 1 center, and I was legitimately contesting his shots, blocking him, and then snagging over him with silver rebound chaser. So it's all about that position, it's all about that box out beast, and um, yeah, this build can pretty much do everything. 97 perimeter defense, Hall of Fame clamps, you don't need it, but you may as well have it on, you know, just go as crazy as you can with the defense. 77 steel it's not bad you can definitely get some pokes if you're smart with your timing 87 block this gives you silver anchor which is huge um as well as the uh gold chase on artists so those are two solid badges and chase down this year i pretty much just run it as high as i can um just because you don't get them as often as you used to 80 offensive rebound 90 defensive rebound that gives you 29 defensive badges um, then looking at the physicals, you do have 86 speed, 79 acceleration, 70 strength, 70 vert, and 90 stamina. For the takeovers, you have lock take, rim take, glass take. This is probably my favorite combo. Uh, when you get team takes, see the future is incredible because with the delayed greens, you're knowing if they're off before anyone else does. So, you know, if I have a teammate down there or if I'm down there, I'll yell I got bored, say it's off, and they'll start leaking out. So a really great badge to have as a secondary takeover when you do have that team take. And Extreme Clamps is just a very solid badge. You're getting steals um, and just playing good perimeter defense. We have shades of Lonzo Ball, Magic Johnson, and James Harden. And this build comes out as a two-way break starter. Um, really cool name for a point guard, and a lot of people just have no clue what this build can do. You know, I'm wide open for almost every corner three I shoot. Every single one's a green. Got that Kyle Kuzma base or the Rudy Gay base. Um, and yeah, you'll knock down all your shots from the corner wide open. It really does not matter. Um, pick a jump shot you're comfortable with. If you're wide open, 77 three ball. You're draining it all day so this is a really solid build incredible defense that's why i made it the point guard spot to guard probably their oversized point guard because if they make anybody shorter than you they're just going to be miserable the whole game they legitimately will not be able to do anything on you and that's that's what's awesome about this build so that's all i've got for you guys uh 